Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Persona 5 Royal with the Lost Frontier Games. On the last episode, we ended up actually finishing our infiltration of Kanashiro's palace as we headed through the final area of his defences, um, getting some more pin codes from little piggy banks in order to uh, get the last uh, barrier down so that we could go to the central elevator and find where his treasure was in some sort of underground vault. Uh, since we already found where the treasure is, we've decided we're going to leave the palace. Uh, however, before we could actually get out of the palace, uh, the twins stopped us and dragged us into the velvet room for a fusion alarm, which is where uh, fusions are temporarily made stronger because they want to make sure we're actually fusing personas, I guess. Um, it didn't last very long, but we ended up being in the velvet room for the rest of the the episode just doing a little bit of fusion and doing some requests for Carolina Justine learning a little bit more about them. Uh, but yeah that's pretty much all we did last episode. Today we are gonna head out of the palace because that's what I've decided is the best idea um, and we'll either do some confidence or if it gets to a rainy day I might go into mementos or I might decide to send the calling card. I've not quite decided yet. I guess we'll figure out when we're out there but for now we can just leave. What do you want to do? They secured our route to the treasure. Do you want to get out of here? Let's return to the real world. Now returning to the real world from Kamashiro's palace. Thank you for your hard work. All right, infiltration log. We did everything. We did literally everything. <laughs> we did the entire palace. I'm so happy that we did it. Man, I'm, I'm just, I, I love getting the entire palace done in one go. It feels so good. Yes! We finally secured our route to the treasure. All we need to do now is send the calling card. Okay. Indeed. We've finished the pre-arrangements. Now we shall face the true test. But this is no time to panic, Joker. Let us ensure we succeed after coming so far. Ah, you're back. Okay. You did great today. You tired? When are we going to send the calling card? We should hurry it up. I have to agree. The earlier the better in my book. There is no assurance he will keep his promise after all. What are your thoughts on the matter, Makoto? Honestly, I can't wait to send it. I want to put an end to his nasty crimes as soon as possible. I agree. Damn, I gotta step up my game. You guys are super passionate. Well, well, we'll be ready to go whenever you are. Er, uh, yeah, I don't know if we'll go in in the next couple days. It'll depend on how confidants and stuff are doing. I'm I'm aware that I need to do a little bit of work for at least on and Yusuke's confidants. Um, I can't do anything for Ryuji at the moment. Um, and they won't ask me out with them because of the calling card. So, hmm. We'll see how we're doing for other confidants, I guess. Hi, Sojuro. Hey. Did you find anyone who will hang out with you at school? Make sure you pick your friends carefully. I, I've, I've chosen them very carefully, Sojuro. Crossword, crossword. Okay, okay, TV first. On Discovery Town Detectives, we visit the Sky Tree, the new landmark in Asakusa. Wow, we're really high up. The view from the observation deck feels like you're walking on air. I'm afraid of heights, so the street stalls at Asakusa might be a better fit for me. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I read the laugh like that, but I did. Alright, let's do a crossword, shall we? Hey, hey! Are you gonna play crossword puzzles? You have other stuff to do, so don't get too into it. Let's do it. I've been waiting for another crossword. Oh, okay, exchanged all over the world. Souvenirs, currency. Probably currency, right? C U R R E N C Y is currency. Yeah. Um, I might as well actually fill in the majority of that word. Oh, it's not currency. Hold on. It can't be currency. Let's erase that. Okay, what's this? Replaced by the. F replaced the franc. Euro? Wait, no, it can't be. Wait, no, it could be euro. Oh, it is currency. I didn't see the U there. I'm, I'm just blind. I'm sorry. It is currency. I just feel like because it's Kanashira's palace, they're gonna have stuff to do with money, right? So currency makes sense, as does all the questions being about money. Dispenses cash and ATM. 
Which is uh, a handy little three letter word there, I guess. Uh, money holder, I, I can't remember the actual word. Abbreviation, that's the word. Money holder, a wallet. This is actually a very easy crossword for once. Wow, beautiful. We did it. All to do with money. I've got it, the answer is currency. Currency, originating from the Latin word currentia, or flowing, the, this term applies specifically to money no matter the medium, though it does not include ca checks or credit. Throughout history, currency has applied to a wide variety of items. Rocks, shells, grain, livestock, feathers, salt, dried fish, wood, bamboo, and even whale teeth. Are we talking about Animal Crossing here? <laughs> oh dear. All right. I see. Oh wow, even I can figure that one out. Nice. Maybe you got a bit smarter after solving these crossword puzzles. Little point into knowledge there, nice. We're doing well for our skills. All right, um, now that that's done, what can I do? Um, I can't do anything in LeBlanc and I don't think I can call Carl Kami. Mm. You look tired. Well, we were in the metaverse after all. Okay, sorry, Moda. That makes sense though. Um, well, in that case, I think we got a DVD. Um, and I think it was a charm DVD, so I, I, I think watching that would be a good idea. How are you doing, Mona? Okay, you can figure out the best time to send the calling card. Just think over it carefully, Joker. Will do. Okay, seat first. Seat first. Hey, you're tired after going to the palace, aren't you? Let's get some rest today. We can after doing some other stuff, though. Nice. Uh, the plant's healthy, so that's good. Let's watch some TV. Oh. Oh yeah, you read it something, right? I did. I got Not So Hot Betsy, which is a charm DVD. Let's watch it. Look at you. How can you expect to write for a fashion magazine when you dress like a fashion victim? Because I really like words and pants. It's a woman's it's a story about a woman struggling against adversity and prejudice. Nice. Looks like it looks have nothing to do with what's inside. I can sympathize with her. Oh, Mona. <laughs> I see. What's really important is not your appearance, but what's on the inside. Maybe you'll learn to think of, or two about charm by watching this drama. Hmm. Well, I mean, Joker's really stylish as well, though. Hey, we're suave now! We're level 3 in charm! We're actually rank 3 in all of our skills. We are a well-rounded individual. All right. Your charm has increased from head-turning to suave. Well then. Well, it's starting to get late. Let's head to bed soon, okay? a seat. Why don't you read something until we get there? That's a good idea. We have the gallant rogue, which is guts. Um, or we have knowledge, proficiency, kindness. I think I'm gonna read the gallant rogue. Hmm? The rich quaked in fear as the poor rejoiced. Wow! Ishikawa Goemon was a thief without peer. So with, he was a hero of the common people, huh? Oh, I didn't realize how long you've been reading. So, how far did you get? Seems like you still have some pages left. You should continue some other time. Oh, we're almost at the station. I'd say that was an efficient use of your time. Oh, yes. I hate how much it rains at this time of year. Speaking of rain, did you know that Teru ter Teru Bozu was originally female? According to one theory, it came from a Chinese paper doll of a girl, the Sao Chin Yan. When it came to Japan, it looked like a monk praying for sunny weather and became male. In the history of the world, it's not uncommon to twist people's genders for politics or religion. Now then, Amamiya-kun, please look at this picture. Here's a question. Some say this tarot card is based off of a woman named Joan. Now, do you know what this woman's position was? I do indeed, Mr. Inui. She was a pope. La Papesse. Uh, actually, La Papesse is um, the priestess rather than the pope, but... Yeah. 
It would make sense for it to be a Pope. I will double check with the network, but I'm absolutely positive it is. I'm surprised that 1% of people actually went for a psychic and a shaman, to be honest. <laughs> We've also read the background of um, a certain persona, so a Pope. This is it. Oh, not bad. That's correct. Pope Joan was a significant figure from the medieval a ages. You're quite the history buff. Joan, or Johanna, as some historians argue, was the Pope of Rome, even though women couldn't be priests. As such, she was a legendary figure and sometimes thought of as an anti-church symbol. Oh, wow, really? Amamiakun seems kind of smart, doesn't he? Nice go! Wow, he must be really smart to be able to answer a question like that. Thanks, Mona. Look at those stars! We're so smart! We must be getting kind of close to leveling up, I guess. According to the legends, Joan was a cross-dressing girl brought from Athens to Rome. Praised throughout the city for her wisdom, she was eventually chosen by the people as Pope. However, when it was discovered that she was a woman, she was stoned to death. The incident was regarded as a taboo by the church. As a result, Joan was stricken from the history books. <sighs> as long as they can do the job, it shouldn't matter if they're a man or a woman. Sheesh, some people. At least Mona knows. <laughs> It's raining. Weather may very well have the same effect on mementos as it has on humans. Well, that's actually what I've been waiting this for. Is why I hate rainy season. To go into mementos. Um, we have a text from On Only for the calling card, but that's just for the calling card. We could go into mementos today. No one else is available. I think going into mementos is actually a wonderful idea on this sunny day. <laughs> because it's raining. Um, is there anything I can... I should buy first? I think we're actually okay for items. We should be okay for healing. Um, and I don't think we'll be fighting that much. So, I think we're just gonna go into mementos. Um, let's at least read An's text. When are we sending the calling card? We found the treasure, so I think we should get on this as soon. I think we should get on this soon. Why not meet up with every, everyone if you're ready? So what should it be? Should we assemble, assemble at the hideout and send the calling card? Let's decide later. Only because I don't want it to automatically send the calling card. I don't think it does that, but I, I don't I don't want to risk it. Let's, um... Yeah, let's head over to the hideout. I'm not going to bother doing anything else. We're just going to head straight on into Mementos. Because I think we're okay for items. Ryuji, hello. Ah, uh, hey, hey, Makoto. Hmm? Is something wrong? Nah, nah, it's nothing. Well, it definitely doesn't seem like it's nothing to you. Uh, so, I I've been doing a little thinking and, uh, how do I put it? Uh, I, I guess I was thinking about coming up with a new move, like a uh, special tag team move kind of thing. So, I got this idea while playing a video game, and, um, uh, it's a move that's gonna need your help. My help? Uh, you know what? <laughs> Never mind. I just saw something like it in the game and thought it looked cool. When I try to say it out loud, it seems too insane. Insane, huh? So, in other words, you may have come across a special attack that outclasses any of our previous moves. I... what? Why don't you tell me your idea? By the way you described it, it must be a pretty good one. Uh... alright. Just... don't get mad at me, okay? I see. <laughs> so stupid, right? Yeah, I was just joking. <laughs> please, please forget what I said. That could work. Uh, yeah, that could work. <laughs> Wait, what? But if we're going to do this, we'll have to push ourselves harder than ever before. Think you can keep up? Yes, ma'am. We're gonna show them the real meaning of pain. We should probably get going now, though. I wouldn't want to make everyone else wait. Yeah. All that's left is the calling card, right? 
We should send it. I would agree, but it will not be an easy task this time. Yeah, nobody actually knows him. <sighs> There's so goddamn much I want to write on the calling card, too. Oh, yeah! Oh, Ren! So, get this. I was talking with Makoto earlier, and we came up with this insane move. Insane? Well, I mean, not in a bad way. It's a bit difficult to explain with words alone. Don't worry, I'll take care of explaining. Alright, so the plan is... Huh? Did it just... Huh? Did the star just light up? What did you say? So it's just like how it reacted with Lady Ann and I last time. It doesn't react at all the other times, though. I don't get how this thing works. This is... Instead of granting wishes, maybe it just offers a bit of support? As long as it benefits us in some way, I'm happy. Then let's try to- let's give it a try when there's an opportunity. Make sure to match my timing, okay? <laughs> yes, ma'am! Alright. Ryuji and Makoto's showtime has been unlocked! That scene between Ryuji and Makoto was super cute as well. I feel like a lot of the- the actual relationships between the Phantom Thieves other than Joker weren't really fleshed out so much in vanilla and actually having these little scenes for their showtimes is really helping with that so far. Um, especially with Ryuji and Mikoto, I think. That was super fun. Like, I was wondering how they would... Because I, I know like a couple of the showtime pairs and stuff because of the trailers. Um, and also just spoiler thumbnails on YouTube, I guess. <laughs> but yeah, I, I was wondering like how these things would come about and how Ryuji and Mikoto would come up with their one and that, that's really fun. I Also the voice acting in that scene was freaking beautiful. Ryuji, I felt so bad for him because he was just so awkward about it. Okay, everyone really wants to send the calling card but we're not going to do that. Um, If I view your requests... Today seems like a perfect day for us to go to Mementos. Let us check our intel. Listen up! Apparently, the Phantom Thieves inspired a larceny group that steals from shops in Shibuya. On top of that, it seems their leader has been physically abusing his younger brother. We can't let these people go around tarnishing the Phantom Thieves' name. I agree. I must agree. Even more so if we are being asked for help. Let us put a stop to this madness. I'm on board. Hi for doing this too. We need to trigger a change of heart in them. No, obje no objections, right? Yep. Hmm. We're good to go if you're okay with it. That's a unanimous decision. Okay, all that's left now is take down the targeting mementos. I actually forgot we had a new one. Okay, well we've got five different targets, so I think we should be good just to go on in and do them. Um, because it'll serve us both a little bit of grinding and also mementos, <laughs> which we've been avoiding doing. So, rather than actually going into the palace today, we are and sending the calling card. We're going to explore mementos and maybe we'll get to see Ryuji and Makoto Showtime at the same time. Oh, I'm excited. Hmm? Shouldn't we focus on the change of heart first? Well, I guess it's okay. Let's see, how many targets do we have? Five of them? Should we get going? Listen, on this is training. We need to make sure we're strong enough. Let's go. Okay, let's go. Wait, you guys, something doesn't seem right. Really, it seems the same to... Oh, hold up, it looks like the Navs reacted to something. A new area has been confirmed in the depths. Updating guidance information. What's this? It sounds like we can go further down now. It's because we made Madarame's palace disappear, right? Most likely, I think. You seem rather uncertain. How far does this Mementos run, anyway? Uh... It's huge! Extremely! You're always so vague when it comes to the important stuff. Like he's kind of flaky as our chief of operations. Don't you want him to try a bit harder too? 
He's doing his best. You truly are different from that moron over there. There, there. I don't fully understand, but mementos and the palaces are related to each other, correct? Then all we must do is continue changing the hearts of evildoers to ascertain its full expanse. I don't believe there's a need to quarrel over it. We should investigate what kind of change occurred. Come on, Joker. Mementos navigation. You can quick travel within Mementos. Open the, the map with R1, select Mementos overview, and choose where you want to go. This can only be done in certain locations, such as in, at the Mementos entrance and the train platforms at the end of each area. Joker. Oh yeah, I have something for you before we head in there. We got two go homes. Nice. Those were the last I had. You're on your own now, okay? Mm. Oh, come to think of it, it's raining today. That might have an effect on Mementos. Huh? Huh? What do you mean? Well, Mementos is affected by the emotions of the public. Um... Wait, so you're saying weathering pe weather changes people's feelings and that in turn changes Mementos? Not just Mementos, the shadows inside, too. The, chi the, the, the type of change will depend on what kind of weather it is. This might turn out to be useful. Bad weather. On days with bad weather like rain, mementos will be more dangerous. However, this is also a chance to get extra items. Enemy reinforcements will be more common, but sometimes they will be rare enemies. Also, the items you may find will be more valuable, and there will be a greater chance of chests. Make good use of these chances. Yeah, that means our, today is our chance to get ahead. Well, I don't think we can expect the rain to have that much of an impact. Let's go! I guess we'll just have to explore and find out. Let's go! Alright, let's start today's job! Indeed, let's do it! Yeah, so Mementos is fun. We've not actually been in since the tutorial thing for it, so this is gonna be interesting. Err, uh, I think this part should be okay for now. Or should I actually have... Actually, I might have Reagent on it instead because the shadows we encounter will mostly be ones from Madarame's palace, I would assume. Joker. Uh, so I will be counting on you instead oh. of uh, Makoto. Yeah. Uh, should I take Yusuke out, or is this okay? You know what? Uh, yeah, no, this should be fine. I have fire, so we can do this. The girls can sit out for now. Let's enter Mementos, shall we? Well then. All right, Joker. What do you want to do? Uh, let's start part way in. Alright, it looks like we can actually start from the path of Kimranut end. Because uh, all of our targets are on the next two paths after that, so let's do that. <sighs> hey, this is where we came last time, right? Yeah, and just as I expected, the path ahead is still open. Alright, time to check it out. Awesome. So we got a new area, finally, that we can head on down into. Well, actually, technically, we've got two areas that we need to go through. <laughs> um, this might take a little while, but it's fine. Hey, good job. That one closed-up door is finally opened. Are you the one who did that? Sure am. I knew it. Mementos filled me in on it. But thank you. I should be able to find more flowers deeper down. Well, I should get going. Good job! Uh... Oh, we bumped into that guy again. Uh, what was his name? You mean Jose, right? He's such an adorable little kid, isn't he? Panther! I'm adorable too, you know! Yeah, yeah. Anyway, he said he was looking for flowers and wanted our help, right? Sounds like he'll reward us too. Doesn't it seem like helping him would be worth it? I, I guess. I am kind of curious about what we'll get. Why don't we go look for them? For him? He's probably still around here. Mm. Looking for him is fine and all, but remember that it's risky to stay in one area for too long. There's this one really fearsome shadow in Mementos. If we hang around too long, it'll hunt us down. For real? Huh? The hell are you talking about? Why didn't you tell us this before? 
The Reaper. If you spend too much time in one area of mementos, a frightening shadow called the Reaper may appear. The Reaper is extremely powerful. Engaging in battle is not advised. If you hear the sound of chains, leave the area immediately. Let's go. We should be fine if we find him quickly. All right, let's get going. All right, we're gonna try and get through mementos pretty quickly because uh, the Reaper is actually very scary. We do not want to get in contact with him. Okay. I do see a little Jose on the map, but also... Well, on to the next try. <laughs> nice work, team. Yeah, the shadows here are, are, are weak. That, that was level 11. So okay. I, I'm pretty much just gonna not use any... They were nothing. I'm gonna try and not use any SP as far as I can. Um, okay, we got some sooty ladies armor. We can sell that over in Kichijoji at least. Uh, there's a little Jose over here on the map. Oh, he must be in the other area. Uh... Oh well, that's fine. I'm assuming that's the Jose icon anyway. It's the same as the one in the Thief's Den. Shadow, what do you want to do, Joker? We're fighting it, obviously. Game over. We actually got a surprising amount of money from that fight. Huh. Okay. <laughs> Child's play. I didn't expect to get that much money. Oh well. Okay. I like how the blue and the red are, are used in mementos. It looks so cool. Uh, okay. Jose, you were out here? Hi! How are how are oh, you doing? Mister. Hi. Hey, good job. Huh. What you got there? That's really neat. Jose is looking at my crystal of lust. Wow. This is amazing. I recognize it from my studies. I'm feeling strong human desires coming from this accessory, but it still hasn't reached its full potential. May I see it? I, I won't do any damage to it. I promise. If I just do this, and then this, done. Here you go, mister. Now that accessory can use its full potential. We got a ring of lust and a ring of vanity. Okay. Let me know if you find any others like it, okay? Learning about desires also teaches me more about humans. Oh. Oh, that's right. Here, before I forget. We got a stamp book. Remember when I told you I'd come up with a fun game for us to play in Mementos? <laughs> I thought of this after seeing the subway in the other world. This will also prove you're checking for flowers in all sorts of places here. The stamps have different rewards than the flowers, so try to get as much of both as you can. Stamps in Mementos. While exploring Mementos, you may find stamp podiums placed by Jose for you. Okay. You will only receive one stamp per podium, but after you've collected multiple stamps, Jose will help you with your investigation. Hey. So, got any flowers for me, mister? If you do, let's trade. I've got some really good stuff. Oh, this menu is so cute! So, first off... Oh, this is such a cute menu! Oh, I love this! Um... Well, let's have a look at items, shall we? I'll trade you some great stuff for some flowers. Uh, Jose, when you speak to Jose and Mementos, you will be able to trade flowers for items. Different items cost different amounts of flowers. The rarer the item, the higher the price. The flowers cannot exist outside of Mementos, so be careful. You will lose all flowers you collected when you leave. Oh, okay. Well, it's not worth hoarding them then. That's good to know. Um, oh, this is how you get the stamina kit S. Oh, I'm going to be aiming for that then. Um, I don't have any flowers at the moment, or, or enough flowers at the moment, so I will wait until I get some more, and then I'll come back. Is this fun, Comic Sans? <laughs> Let's have a look at Cognition. I can change mementos for you in all sorts of ways. Cognition changes in mementos. When you collect stamps, you will obtain points that you can use to, to have... Jose changed the environmental cognition. By changing the cognition, you'll be able to increase the amount of money, experience, or items you can obtain in, me in mementos. 
You will be able to choose which effect to increase by delegating points. Use your points wisely to make your investigation easier. You can reset the points you delegated by using flowers. However, the more points you delegated, the more flowers you will need. To view the current cognition change, press R1 to pull up the main map. You can check the status anytime during your investigation. Okay, this is cool. So we can get EXP up, money rewards, items up. That's very cool. Obviously we've not found any stamps yet, so we can't do any of that, but... Man, EXP and money up, especially some like things that I want. That's really cool. Okay, we'll come back for that later, but man, yeah, I like this. Uh, so that's all we can do at the moment. Let's let's just have to go away, I guess. Speaking of... Oh, right! I should mention something about those flowers you're collecting. For some reason, you can't leave mementos with them. They'll disappear on you. It's weird. But it'd be so sad to collect flowers just to have them disappear on you. What a waste, am I right? So don't forget to come bring them to me before you leave Mementos, okay? Doing good? That should do it. Good job! Look at all the stars up here, they're so cute! Oh, I like Jose a lot. He's very cute. He's like a little bright light in the dark corners of Mementos. Anyway, for now we can't really do anything with him, so I guess we'll just head on over and out. Get some more flowers for our troubles. Err... Uh, oh, hi there, Shadow. Bye! On to the next drive. <laughs> nice work, team. Fox certainly dispatched of that one quickly. <laughs> that went well. Okay. Oh man. No match for me. One hit to that disaster shadow, and then it just boom. It was beautiful. Who's next? A spectacular victory. I tried asking that one for money, and it really I shouldn't have. Okay. I got barely anything. Oh well, that's fine. All right. So, I feel like they've made mementos way better by adding in these things with Jose. The platform. That takes care of this area. Oh hey, there's a, there's a stamp thing. Hey, this stand here. Hey, the, looks like there's a stamp thing here. Might be that stuff Jose was talking about. Just looking at it is making me want to get stamina like crazy. Skull, you're such a caveman. He said to look for these as well as the flowers. Let's stamp it down, Joker. Okay, point found. This is very cute. Um, is that everything here? Yeah? Cool, okay. I... Let me just have a... Okay, Jose's still there. Um... I wonder if he'll just stay there. Did I... I missed a chest? Where did I miss a chest? Um... I guess we'll head back and try and find that chest that I missed. Hi, don't mind me. Um, yeah, I kind of just want to ignore these shadows for now. Um, oh, running on the tracks really does a number on my feet. You mean tires, right? No, he means feet. <laughs> Probably. The, the feet equate to tires, don't they? Oh, maybe it got respawned? Hmm. I don't think it would, but it must have done. Oh well, um... Well, now that we've found the way down, I guess we could probably just quick travel to the end, right? Unless there's more flowers to get? Uh... Should I talk to Jose? I've only got 23 flowers, but... Is this seat cow high? It's quite comfortable. Well, it's all Mona, so it ain't cow. What kind of material is it? Well, it ain't cow. <laughs> It's cat, I think. Um, actually, yeah, what is it? Ooh. You know what? I think we'll leave because I'm worried the Reaper might come. Uh, we'll find Josie again later. It's fine. You know, this palace's security level doesn't seem to change, even if the enemies spot you. Mementos is different. While other palaces exist just because of just one person, this one's from the public. From that perspective, it'd take more than a few intruders to be make a mark on the security level. You'd have to do something so bad that the entire public sees you as an enemy. So be careful, okay, Skull? Hey, shut up! Hmm? I can sense our target hey. somewhere in this area. Let's scour this floor for them. Okay, good. We finally got some a target around here somewhere. Let, let's go and look for the target. Uh, that should probably be our first port call. Hello, don't mind me. I, th I feel like 
because we're over leveled for this area, the shadows won't follow us. Oh. Yeah, it's running away from us because we're higher level than it. So that's good. Oh, it's a stamp point. Hi there. Okay, that looks like it's two out of eight. Uh, they're so cute. Jose's whole aesthetic is really cute. I like Jose a lot. Okay, <laughs> what's over this way? Oh, this is the way to the that bit. Well, we'll come back for that. Um, is there anything down here? No. Okay. I should start a hobby. Broaden my horizons. Cycling, or perhaps a marathon. That sounds fun. You should look at lots of options. Oh, that's such a. Oh, I love the momentous um, conversations that they have. They're so fun. I hope Yusuke does get another hobby, because obviously art is like his whole life, but running in a marathon would help him keep his um, health up. I also make him stronger for the metaverse. Look, a treasure chest. Why don't we crack it open? Hell yeah, let's do it. Alert capsule, and then we should get something nice from the other one, I would assume. Hello, don't mind me. I meant to open the chest. <laughs> Losers. A spectacular victory. Yeah, they, we're so over leveled for this area. <laughs> but that's gonna make it quick to. Fusion alarm. I'm getting an uneasy feeling. Occurrences of a fusion alarm. Winning battles may trigger a fusion alarm. Successive wins increase the chances, but each alarm decreases them. Several can occur in one day. Go to the belt room during a fusion alarm and try to fuse a powerful persona. I think we're gonna leave that. Keep it up. We're gonna leave that for now. Oh. Err, we will open this locked chest though. Um, yeah. I'm not super bothered about the fusion alarm right now. Um, because we're not fighting any strong enemies right now, it's fine. <laughs> I'll leave it. Um, if several could occur in one day, another one will happen. Uh, okay, looks like that's just the way down. I'm gonna grab this stamp for Jose. Nice! And then we can go back and... I can feel it. Just gonna double check there. Um, we can go back and do the target. Because, yeah. I love that we're over leveled for this area. It's actually making it so easy just to cruise through here. Hi, don't mind me. Uh, it's, it's really refreshing, actually. Hmm? Hmm? I can sense a target up ahead. Do you want to head in? Let's go. Oh, that's Takanashi's shadow, right? This guy's bullying is pretty bad. From what I hear, it's mostly blackmail. Taking money from people. That kind of thing. If we don't make him have a change of heart, his bullying might get even worse. Let's go! Well, yeah, let's go. Hi. It's not my fault. It's theirs for not standing up for themselves. What was that? That's no reason. How's it their fault when you don't give them any choice, huh? You're the lowest of the low. Bullying people weaker than you, knowing they can't fight back. Come at me, bro. The hell? You're all ganging up on me, too. Are you the Phantom Thieves some kind of gang? Protectors of justice, my ass. Don't add high and mighty with me when you don't know anything. You're the one who doesn't know anything. Let's get him. I already told you I didn't do anything wrong. Listen to me, damn it. Hi, Jack Frost. How are you doing? Uh, I don't have on. I have Yusuke, so this is fine. It, it is probably still weak to fire, though. Um, I will use my good... Boy. Oh, did I get rid of the one that has. I, I did. I got rid of the one that has Magi Agi Lao. So I only have Maragi. Well, okay, I'll use Lina Sheet. Oh, okay. You know what? That's fair. That's fair. Uh, Lucky Punch. I didn't think that was gonna work. <laughs> Zio, sure. Uh, and you know what? Take a giant slice of the face. Oh, oh no, he's afraid. Oh 
<laughs> well, this is fine. Finish him off, Mona. Alright, we got some money, we got some XP, we're all good. I had some levels, nice. I didn't have a choice. But if I didn't do it, they're gonna hurt me. I don't want people taking my money from me anymore. What? What are you talking about? If I don't go after him, I'm the one who's gonna get bullied. I can't say it, I just can't. Oh, I get it now. There's an even bigger bully ordering this guy around who's behind all this. Hey, don't you- did you just say it's people's own fault for not standing up for themselves? That's... <laughs> Please help me. Alright. Thank you, oh thank you, you wonderful man of thieves. This guy. Fickle fellow, isn't he? I'm counting on you. You guys promised. <laughs> Fine, but you better apologize to those people you bullied. Alright, we got a treasure. They got a protein. <laughs> and we re finished the request Bark and Bite of a Bully. Hmm. Impressive leadership. Well, what's next? Do you want to continue exploring? How many targets left in this area? Three? Okay then, what's our next move, Joker? Let's keep going. Let's do that. There must be more places to explore. Indeed, I believe that there are. Especially with three targets left on this area alone. <laughs> do you want to leave, Joker? Let's go. Er, uh, if I'm not mistaken, we should just be able to- Oh! The target is coming from the next area. Let's go check that area out. Well, before we do that, though, I do see this treasure demon here. Hi! There we go, got some money and experience. It's always okay. worth it. Easier than cleaning my brushes. I guess that's because it's raining, huh? Well, now we can go to a lower area because, um, we already got that platform unlocked. So we can just quite travel there. Okay. I can sense our target somewhere in this area. Let's scour this floor for them. Let's do that, Mona. Uh, I do see some some flowers around here as well, so we'll, we'll pick those up, of course. Uh, Josie is, after all, one of our priorities. Oh, hello. We already found the thing. Well, we'll do that in a moment. Uh, I'm gonna finish looking through this area first. Look, a treasure chest. Why don't we crack it open? Let's do it, Mona. Yeah, I, I feel like we're gonna get a lot of just kind of low-level items here because this is a very low-level area, but that's okay. That's understandable given that we put it off for so long. And I'm glad There's that we did chest. because it wasn't worth coming in before we got a good amount of targets to fight. Is it just me or is instant ramen even better uncooked? It's just you. Yeah, um, I know some people who eat it on its own, but I wouldn't. <laughs> uh, like, not unless you absolutely have to. Oh, a treasure chest. This is what thievery is about. I love Yusuke's voice lines. <laughs> I love all of their voice lines. But he, he just, he sounds so happy with himself. It, it's wonderful. I'm glad that he's happy with himself. Hi, don't mind me. All right, we found the next platform. Boing. And that's half of the stamps found. It's somewhere. Which is also nice. Err... Uh, I keep checking the third eye at the platforms because apparently there's like a, an item that can spawn on- This place is kinda... Uh, yeah. Maybe there are ghosts around? Uh, don't say weird stuff like that! Now I have to watch my back! <laughs> It'll be fine. There's shadows about, but must be something good inside. Yeah. Um. Oh. Apparently, at the platforms, an item can spawn that gives you some good treasure. I think. Uh, but it's kind of rare, and it's difficult to see because it's dark. So I keep using third eye to see if we've got one, but um, I'm not sure we'll ever see one. I don't know if they were in vanilla or not because I never saw them in vanilla. But that may just be because they were hard to see. 
I don't know. I didn't really look around to the platform before. Oh, I need a drink. Something real fizzy. <sighs> You're such a kid, Skull. Drink your milk and grow up. <laughs> I I know that that's probably just like a drink your milk so that you get a strong, like taller joke, but it, it just calls to mind the image of them all sitting in the Mona van with like little cartons of milk. Oh mm -hmm. dear. I can, I can sense the target up ahead. Do you want to head in? Let's go. Hey, that old man must be Ono. Let's stop him before he causes any more trouble for the others. Just for others, not just not the others. Anyway, hello. How are you doing? Oh, what the hell? Who the hell are you people? Do you have some problem with me, Heiji Ono? Come on. That's the first thing out of his mouth. But it seems like this old guy is the one who's making trouble at Kichi Joji. Nice. Nice, I can tell you're annoyed even with your masks on. That shows how interested you are in me, Heiji Ono. Right? Right? How unsightly. He's certainly disturbed. Let's end this, Joker. I'm gonna beat you down. Yes, yes, get mad. Look at me, Heiji Ono. Payback time, kid. Hmm, what kind of... Wait, what? Ow! My body aches! It always hurts like this when it's raining. But for the sake of causing trouble, I can ignore the pain. Um, you probably shouldn't ignore now. the pain if it's making you, you unhappy. Champion's Cup? Restores medium amount of HP and increases attack for one ally for three turns. With oh! Okay, that must be because of Kamashida's Will Seed. That's cool. Okay, I didn't notice that before. Uh, use a rising slash. This is fine. This is absolutely fine. Why don't you use a media? Much thanks. Okay. We're just gonna take this thing down. He's so weak. Should I feel bad? I kind of don't. <laughs> er, this is fine. Alright, we got money experience. We're all good. Add a level for on. Nice. Oh cool, she got fire break. That negates fire resistance on all foes. Nice. I knew I was wrong. It started with something small. Whenever I do something stupid, my family would worry about me. My son usually treats me like I'm worthless, but he would care for me in those times. There's no other way. It felt so good that I started seeking that kind of affection everywhere. I ended up causing so much trouble. Hmm. An unfortunate consequence of isolation. Yeah, sorry. I've caused so much trouble. How am I supposed to live like this? By apologizing. Apologize? It's too late for that. I'm so embarrassed. No, the important thing is to start making up for it. That's true. I'm certain that's what your family wishes as well. And from now on, instead of taking it out on others, you should communicate your needs directly to your family. Tell them you're lonely before it's too late. Well, let me make it up to you. Yeah, I'll do that. We got a nuisance bell, okay. And we, we completed the request, an elderly's meaning of life. Well, that's that. What now? You want to keep exploring? How many targets left in this area? 
too? Okay, then what's our next move, Joker? Let's keep going. Okay, I'm ready to go. It, are you okay, Fox? Man, he was talking about like family in isolation and I thought about Yusuke's situation with Madarame. Oh. Yeah, it, it's kind of no wonder he got involved in that conversation there. Oh, I hope he's okay. I hope the old man is okay too. Uh, man, he must be really desperate. Anyway. The target is close. It feels like it's in an area a little bit further past here. Well, that'll be probably the area after next, or one after that, maybe? Or, uh, in any case, I guess we could just continue on to a lower area again. Huh? Huh? Those are... They're people, right? No. Well, I'd say they're most likely shadows. What are shadows doing here? It's not like they're going to be catching a traitor. It stopped? Oh, they got in. Come on, man. Hey, where's that go? If I had to guess, I'd say into the deepest part of Mementos. What? This place seriously don't make any sense. Also, what's this on the platform? Is this... Isn't it a waiting room? I didn't expect there would be one here. It looks like we'll be able to use this to take a break. Make sure to utilize it well, Joker. Hey. Uh, but seriously, what's up with this place? Shadows ain't gonna attack us here? Hmm. It seems like this is some other kind of safe zone separate from the other areas. Waiting rooms. You will occasionally find waiting rooms in mementos. Just like safe rooms, you can quick travel and save your game from there. Hooray! We found a safe room! I love the the waiting room safe rooms. They're fun. We'll consult in a second, but first, we got a stamp. Yay! 5 of 8. It's very satisfying to stamp those down. Okay. How y'all doing, friends? Well, what are you gonna do, Joker? Let's talk to the team. What do you want to talk about? How's our progress? May I get a word in? I've been wondering, is there a possibility that we will find our own shadows within Mementos? That's not possible. Our shadows are always by our side, remember? Oh right, our personas. Now then, acknowledging, facing, and becoming, uh, and becoming able to wield your own shadow is what makes you into a persona user. That's why we can't have palaces. It's also why our shadows can't exist in other people's palaces. Uh, but we saw Panther's shadow over in Kamashita's palace. Wait! Hey, that thing was not mine. That was just a cognition formed by Kamashita's mind. It was nothing like Panther's actual shadow. Hmm. So, wielding a persona involves acknowledging one's shadow. Considering that fact, Joker's ability to control multiple personas is truly special. Right? That just proves my judgment of him was correct. Uh, you were real surprised too when it happened. What are your thoughts? Is there anything else you want to discuss? Uh, no, I think we're good. Shall we go? You're right. We should get going. I'm kind of curious, then. They were talking about shadows existing in other people's palaces. We've not really seen that yet, but... I wonder... Like, how does someone's... Like, inner conscience inner conscious get into someone else's inner conscious basically oh, that's interesting I'm so curious oh they're giving me more information that I'm, I'm just interested by anyway um, I think we can probably head on a little bit further into mementos today uh, if this episode runs a bit long I'm sorry I'd like to just try and get as much done in mementos as we can um, so at the very least finishing this this path of momentum would be good and then we can maybe do the next one next episode. Let's do that anyway. Joker! Oh, Joker! I almost forgot to mention. In Mementos, sometimes the road will be unnaturally blocked. 
the walls are pretty weak in those spots. I should be able to break through them, no problem. If you see if you see any while we're exploring, try busting right through them. In Memento, so you can press X to destroy weak walls that look different from normal. Try to break these walls whenever you can. There may be something hidden behind them. <sighs> uh, just let us know before you do that. Don't go crashing into walls before we can buckle up. Are there seatbelts in the monomobile? I don't think there are, but... Well, in any case, let's continue our exploration. I'm working pretty hard today, huh? I wouldn't mind sushi for dinner. Well, Joker, you heard the cat. Convenience store sushi tonight? Oh, hell yeah, let's get some convenience store sushi. He probably wants some um, fancy sushi, knowing Morgana, but... <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Oh man, that's so fun to think about though. Like, do, do they do they get what do they do for dinner? They can't always have curry. Does Joker feed himself? I suppose he must. Huh. That sounds like so lonely. Can't see ahead with this darkness. <laughs> you only need my light to illuminate the darkness. But how do your lights work, Mona? I guess that's another magical thing that you can do. No gas, no emissions. <laughs> you make a pretty green car. That's me. I'm nice to people and the earth. Oh, that's so sweet. <laughs> He's nice to people and the earth. Mona the, the green mobile. Okay. I, th I think we maybe have gotten everything in this area. Um, in which case, we can just quick travel to the next area. At least that was quite quick, and because the shadows aren't attacking us. Hey, this next area has a different feel to it somehow. What is this? No. No, we should focus on what's right in front of us for now. I feel the presence of a target ahead. Let's search the whole area. I have something. Okay. Sure, Mona. It's interesting how much he can sense about mementos. I guess because he knows so much more about the metaverse as well. By the way... You did all the necessary shopping, right? Yeah. I mean, it was mostly necessary. Panther, on um, what what did you buy that we didn't need? Did you buy crepes again? <laughs> oh man. Oh, there is a target in this area. I don't know why I thought there wasn't, but whatever. Oh, we found the next platform. I will grab the stamp while we're here. Um, I wonder if they've changed it so that the conversations don't get interrupted when you click on doors and stuff. Hmm. I can't really tell. Uh, is, is that it? Have we been everywhere? The other day, I was asked to draw for something called a doujinshi. Uh, your style's not exactly... Well, I don't know. Maybe it'd be a hit. Oh my gosh, I love that conversation. <laughs> Oh, just imagining Yusuke drawing Dojin. <laughs> what would he even draw Dojin of? What, what was he being asked to draw Dojin of? <laughs> I'm so curious. Oh, man. Treasure chest spotted. Let's open it. Oh, the poor boy. He doesn't know what Dojin is anyway. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, let's let's head over to the, the target area because I think we've looked at everything in this part of Mementos now. Um, we could go ahead and do that boss fight, and it'll be fine. What should my next work be? A subway? Train tracks? Hmm. Think about that after we've done our job. <laughs> Stay on task, Yusuke. Oh, oh, oh yeah. I, I heard something recently, so I decided to test it just now. Um, I'm gonna put my remote right by the mic. If you uh, play around with the touchpad, then Mona makes noises through the remote. <laughs> oh god, that's so silly. I love it. I don't think that was a thing in, in Classic, in Vanilla, but I can go back and check. Huh? Uh, okay, so it's the target up ahead. Let's go. Yoko Aino. Let's change her heart for the sake of all the cats in Yongen. Ah, yes. The crazy cat lady. Hi. Please stop what you're doing. Hey. Yoko Aino, you're gonna let all the cats in Yongen go. No. 
Without me, Snowball and all the other kitties won't be happy and safe. Other kitties? Hey, what are you talking about? Snowball? <laughs> come here, kitty. You gotta come over, too. to protect the snowballs. I won't let anyone stand in my way. Hi, Shadow Idol Nekomata. Um, I don't remember what Nekomata is actually weak to. We're just going to try some stuff, I guess. Uh, you know what? I, I will try Sio. Oh, well, it, it did a decent amount of damage either way. Let's do Garu as well. If I'm gone, there won't be anyone protecting the snowballs. Joker, it seems like there's something going on with this one. Maybe we should try talking to them. Okay, here's what we know about her. She's calling the cat she catnapped snowballs, and the catnapped cats are stressed out. And lastly, the pet owners are giving up. By choosing the correct answers, you'll be able to change the target's heart. This is new. Use the information you have obtained to charge, change the target's heart. What do you want? All I want is to protect the snowballs. I have to protect them. I just have to protect them. Hmm. The pet owners are giving up. She doesn't seem to want to give up. I feel like saying just give up would only make her more upset. But I feel like saying calm down is a terrible option as well. Um... Do you want to know more information though? Uh just give up. You're nothing but a child! There's no way I'll give up! Hey wait! Crap, we can calm her down. We'll have to find a different way. Dang it! I knew that was wrong as well. Why did I do that? Why did I do that? Also, I'm curious if if I get Mona to attack again. All I want to do is protect the snowballs! Uh, okay, well let's try the other option this time. Calm down. I am calm. Of course I'm calm. Um, I need to stay calm for the snowballs. Man, what does she mean by snowballs? That's so weird. Are all cats snowballs? Snowballs are snowballs. Are there a lot of snowballs? What do you want? That's right. They're all snowballs. I have to protect them. Huh? As long as I protect them, the snowballs will be happy. You don't seem happy. You're nothing but a child. I don't give a damn about my happiness. All that matters is keeping the snowballs safe. Hey, wait. Okay, that didn't work. So brave. I won't lose. There's no way! If I'm gone, who's going to protect all the snowballs? By choosing the correct answer, you'll be able to change the target's heart. Use the information you've obtained to change the target's heart. I get the feeling we have to do it that way. Which I'm actually kind of glad about, because I do want to see that through to its end, if I can. As long as I protect them, the snowballs will be happy. The cats are stressed out. Oh, well, that's... But if I don't keep an eye out for the snowballs, they'll die too. Hmm, they'll die too? So the real snowball is already gone. Okay, I think I've got this. She's calm enough for us to talk now. Go for it, Joker. Snowball is gone. Ah, you're right! Okay, this is a very interesting new mechanic here. Okay, it's a bit like the shadow negotiations. But it's like a little bit different as well. 
I really like it actually. Just talking to them to, to try and change their heart. It's gonna be interesting to see how this plays out. All right, got a level, nice. I leveled up. Nice. Because I found this white kitten and took it home, but it wandered outside when I wasn't looking. And then I saw it get run over by a car. The car just kept driving, even after it ran over the kitten. Since then, I see that kitten in every cat. I always think I have to protect it this time. Hmm. It brought you a lot of suffering, huh? No. The people who really suffered are the owners and their cats. It's alright. You realized your mistake. Just don't do something like this again. Yes. Thank you, Mr. Kitty. Um, I have a lot of cat food at my place. So please come over sometime. No! I am not a cat! But that sounds nice. Thanks! Thank you. We got a cat brooch. And we request completed with... We completed the request if cats disappear from the city. Well then. That takes care of that. Should, what should we do now? Want to continue exploring? Uh, how many targets left in this area? One? Okay then, what's our next move, Joker? Let's keep going. Because uh, he's saying to make more money. I think we have another target to take care of, Mona. Man, that kind of hurt. Ah. Because, man, she saw a cat run over and then not being able to, like a kitten, and not being able to protect it to hurt her that much. The target is coming from the next area. Let's go check that area out. Okay, let's do that. Oh! There, that's the shadow of that girl named Shimizu. Ugh, scary. She really seems like a sadist. She's calling someone her slave and ordering him around, right? I should have known. In a way, she's denying his existence. I certainly wouldn't want to be a victim of that. Let's go talk to her. Let's do that in a moment. Let's stop this first. Nice. Right, let's go and talk to this sadist lady. Hello. <laughs> so you're the pigs who wrote that calling card online? Why do I deserve this? <laughs> it's cause you made some guy your slave. That's all kinds of wrong there. That's what he wants. He worships me more than any god you know. Um, I don't know where to begin to explain how you're wrong. I beat him and I hurt him and he sees it as a sign of our love and friendship. He's so happy. Hold a moment. You are so delusional. Um, it's all about me. I'm pretty and my grades are good. It's my right to order people around. I'll start by giving orders to you pigs. Lick my shoes, peasants. You're going down. I'll never give up, Emoto. He belongs to me. Being my slave is what makes me him happy. Hi, Yaxini. How you doing? I fought a lot of this persona when we were in Kanoshira's palace and it was weak to nuclear there, so I'll, I'll probably try that. I, thou. Er, I will try Bufu as well. Wait. Yeah, that's fine. Um, okay, well I'm gonna try free. See if that works. Nope, okay. Oh! Oh no! Such a fun what voice line. Oh, look at him being so angry down there as well. Oh, that's so cute. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. This is my other self. Well, this is going well. Um, this is fine. Oh, good. I froze her. I can get a technical with this. Um, let's go ahead and do it with Frey so that it's not something that she is resistant to. Yeah. 
And now we can do a little all attack with three of us. Lord is too angry. <laughs> I see. Yeah? Well, I don't think you're gonna go home. I have been waiting for this! Oh my god, yes! It's showtime! It's showtime! Time to get a little crazy! Stay focused! Go for it! Thanks, ma'am. Thanks. That is such a fun showtime, oh my goodness. Oh, that was so cute. Oh, with like, both of them being physical fighters, it makes a lot of sense for them both just to be like, taking down this this enemy, I guess, in a tether of all things. That's so fun. What was he playing? Red Dead Redemption? <laughs> I've not played Red, Red, Red Dead Redemption. I, I just saw trailers for it. Um, <laughs> and the banter at the end there. Oh, that was so fun. <laughs> nice. All right, we got some levels and a new skill. Huh? You got a new skill? Man, I forgot I had slime on. No, no, no! Oh, I don't want to lose him. He's mine. He's mine. Isn't he? Keep this up and he'll hate you. I could never stand that. Why did you start treating him like that? Oh, what was I doing? He just kept going along with it, so I misunderstood and thought I could do anything I wanted. Actually, I wanted to be more than friends with him. Huh? More than friends? You mean like a boyfriend? Yeah. I had a crush on him, but I got possessive. Those feelings went out of control. Yeah. Be careful that you don't make things worse for yourself than they already are. Ah, the treasure has shown itself. We got a whip sword. And we re finished the request. Sadism is a sight of, sight of love. All right, well, with that done, it looks like we're at the end of this area of Mementos. Uh, if we look at the map, um, yeah, we got all eight stamps, so we're doing pretty well. What is a bit hurt, but you know. Whoa, we did it! This is because more people believe in us now, right? There ha that has to be it. Now then, let's get in there. Actually, Mona, I think what we're gonna do is quick travel back to the top of Memento Mementos because we should be able to quick travel back to that end area. Uh, and we're gonna actually finish off there because, as I said, uh, Mementos is fun, but we've been here for a little while. So I think stopping here for today would be a good idea. Next time, we can go through the next area of Mementos and get rid of those other targets that we have. Err... Uh, but yeah, for now, hi! Thanks for watching! I hope you enjoyed this episode. Please feel free to let me know down below what you thought of everything that happened in this episode here today, including going through memen me Mementos? <laughs> going through Mementos, uh, talking with Jose, doing all of our different targets. Yeah, just if you have any thoughts on any of that- oh, and obviously Makoto and Ryuji's Showtime. If you have any thoughts on any of that, feel free to let us know down below. Uh, next time we will go through the next area of Mementos, finish off our last two targets there, and probably like leave and do some confidants or something after that. But for now, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. I hope you have a great day, night, or whatever the time it is for you. And I will see you next time.